Welcome back. This is Tommy. We're going to talk about men. Men are for the 2021, which we all need and what's coming our way. Men, we need to step up. And I'm not just talking about just one particular man, even me. We have to be there. We have to be strong. We have to be hungry. We have to be willing to make sacrifice and willing to make money and get a hustle on, legit hustle. Because we don't respect ourselves. We think everything's supposed to be handed to us, to us, and and I fall into this lab. We don't love ourselves. We don't love our mate. We don't love anybody. We just out for ourselves. But we need to be men, men for the futures, and we need to stop just laying around with anything that walks and settle down and try to figure out what is our fam what what is our goal for life, because. Selling drugs and having six baby mothers and ten girlfriends and and side pieces and everything else. We don't need that. We need family. We need men. We need men to survive. We need men to, to fight, to 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 provide. We need strong men. We need strong men for these women. Alright? But don't worry, women, your video's next. But for the men you need to be men. You need to learn how to cook, clean, and stand by your word. It's hard. I fall sometimes too. But if I give my word or if I'm with someone, I'm going to protect them at all costs. And I want to make sure they don't go hungry. I'm going to make sure they have a roof over their heads. Because right now, there's a lot of families who's about to get evicted. And some of them is probably your, your baby mother, your wife your family members. We need to come together. We need strong male influence in life. Bunk what the media says, bunk with 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 you know celebrity says we need strong men not to just lay with a woman but to be with a woman and to respect that woman. Alright? And to love that woman and love your kids because the kids don't have a role model. Celebrities are not role models. Lawyers are not role models. Politicians are not role models because they didn't make the kids. They could give you advice, they could give you kids advice. When it's all said and done, you're the father. Okay? And if you have kids and you was being stupid, respect the father, the man who stepped in your place to take over where you fell fall, fall flat on and where you should be like, look, I respect you. And I try to fight him and I try to do anything wrong with him. Be like, look, I respect you. You did what you what you had to do. I wasn't a father, but I'm trying to be there. What do you need? And come together because men are stronger together, not divided. It doesn't, it doesn't matter what skin color you are. It does not matter your age. It doesn't matter if you're rich or poor. Men need to come together. Especially for the young men. Because the young men, when I was growing up, you had four choices. Go to school or sell drugs. And if you do sell drugs, you're, you're going to go to jail or you're going to die. Now you only have three choices, two choices. Sell drugs or die. You don't have those. you, you got to make your own options not to, to go that road. Because I have friends who are in jail. I have family members who are in jail. I have friends who's out of jail that's trying to make a life. You don't want that for your son or daughter to live the way you was living. Okay? And granted, I'm single. I don't have kids, but I have a lot of nieces and nephews. And I work my butt off to make sure they know I'm there financially and mentally and spiritually. They might not like what I say, but they know I'm coming. it's coming from the heart. And I know what I'm talking about, all right? So men, step up, please, for the youth. Because this, what's coming 2021 and beyond, they're going to need a strong male figure, okay? And if a woman don't respect you for you doing a legit job, she's not the one, all right? I'm starting to learn that, okay? Now hit that like, subscribe, and this is real talk.
Okay, I don't sugarcoat, I don't do nothing. This is my experience. I got 12 sisters, three brothers. The list goes on and on. I live different lives that will make you guess and wonder. All right, hit that like, subscribe, feedbacks, please. And make sure you hit that like button. I need some more likes, all right? Thanks, bye.